welcome back this vlog is about pregnancy as you can tell I wanted to make this video because the birth rate in uh, my country is very high so and it isn't just my country this is for other people too but I'm about to list, list some things you could do to prevent pregnancy because it's 2017 and too much people trying to play the victim and people need to understand that there's so much things out here you can do to prevent pregnancies that there's little like little room for error like you can't really you can't play the victim card so number one abstinence uh that's a basic one don't have sex until you're married or at least don't have, have sex until a certain point in your life or whatever number two condoms obviously um it's male condoms female condoms strap up nigga ladies if you don't have a condom you should have condoms in your house for your man or whatever nigga if, if he in your man if he's just a random nigga um just pull it out the jaw of each size you know you let him fit one you know or you can use the female condoms slip them in wear them they work 99% of the time condoms can't go wrong I'm gonna pause it right there. The only way I'll actually give you an exception of getting pregnant using condoms is if the com if the condom didn't work, if it burst or something. You know, like he was trying to put it on and you know, he decked too hard or yeah, too pointy and he thought the cum was too strong. So you just he just busting you and you and you you didn't know that the condom was in you know how it was. So I, I, I wouldn't blame anybody for that situation. But that's like only one situation. Birth control. Number three. Birth control. Uh, they work 99% of the time. You use it right. Uh, the only way. I'll give you a pass-ish. To play the victim guard. If you did if you missed a day. I mean. If you're taking birth control. You should know um, your days. You should know your days. So. I don't know how you miss a day, but uh, yeah. The fourth one is uh, the Plan B bill. Okay, let's say you get past all of that. Yeah, you didn't want to wait for sex, or you just decided to have sex. Uh, you didn't use a condom. Past that, you didn't use birth control. So what you end up doing is coming in on in your girl, or the guy and I'm coming in. It. Like you wanted his cum, he couldn't pull out something happened. The cum get there somehow. You can take the plan B pill. It stops um the pregnancy. It stops the pregnancy. Uh it works according to research, it works perfectly if you take it within twenty four hours of insemination. Um but you could also take it within five days, so that's that's something too. So that's great. Great plan B pill. Those are basically a few options I had to avoid pregnancies. It's 2017. You can't, you can't, um, can't be playing the victim card. Now, there's two more options I have. Now, this is, gets to debatable. The, the other options, they were like, they were like on everyone's list. Everyone's list. These two legs options, it all depends on who you are or your belief or what's not. The next one is abortion. Now that's a that's a shaky topic, but I'm for abortion. Uh, I mean, I don't like it, but I just I feel as if everyone has the the right to to do it. So yeah, abortion. That's the next one if you wanna take that route, and adoption if you wanna take that route. Those two are like post pregnancies. So. Those are some ways you could use to prevent pregnancies in 2017. That's why I feel as if people shouldn't play the victim card. Oh well, I didn't, I, I, I didn't think I was gonna get pregnant when I was gonna do it. Uh, like, come on, man, you could have prevented it. Another thing is, and people need to understand: don't have kids unless you are financially stable it's no point of having kids unless you're financially stable kids they're like leeches you know you need money because i know what you're thinking 
Money isn't everything. Eh. Money is what you use to buy your food. Money is what you use to pay your bills. Money is used what you go out to party in. Um, what you put your ass in the car. That's what you use money for. So don't, don't sit there and try to say you don't need money or anything. You, you need money for a kid. And kids are expensive. You, you need to do it legally. So yeah. Don't have kids until you're financially stable. If you have kids before then, then great. Great. Do you. But you know. But at least make sure you know what you're doing. You got the right money to do it. If you don't, then too bad, too sad, I guess. But that's just, that's just one little quick video for you. That's it. Um, I'm trying to rush this. I would have gone in a little more depth. But I was trying to rush this before, before I go away. Uh, so I was trying to rush a bunch of videos. I'll be editing all week. All week I'll be editing. So I was trying to rush this video. So that's this is basically it. There's more videos to come. Keep in touch. Stay tuned. Hello. If you did like that shit, why don't you click that video up there? If not, uh, click that one right there. <laughs> come on. It won't hurt. Click the video.